nothing will last forever, and every legend, no matter how great, fades with time. With each passing year, more and more details are lost, until all that remains is truth. To put it simply, lies. And yet in all the known universe, and here in our lands, the legend of endures, a bit self-evident fact. Indeed, it's only a troubled land there's need for you, and ours was pushed to have for long Four heroes such as these. Gabriel, the warrior, before whose sword all combatants would tremble. Eligar, redstone engineer, whose machines era of invention. And the rogue, who would channel his destructive creativity for the benefit of all. And Soren, the architect, builder of worlds, and leader of the Order of the Stone. These four friends together would give so much to gain their rightful place as four heroes. Their greatest quest would take them on a dangerous journey to fight a mysterious creature known as the Ender Dragon. In the end, the Order of the Stone emerged victorious and the dragon was defeated. Their story complete, they slipped away into the pages of legend. But when one story ends, another one begins. Would you rather fight a hundred chicken-sized zombies or ten zombie-sized chickens? Yeah. Just to be clear, you wouldn't have any weapons yeah. or armor. That's easy. I'll take the, uh, the little tiny little zombies. A hundred of them, crawling all over you with their tiny hands. Uh, All I'd need is, like, a shovel. I'm telling you, way too easy. So, I've got a daylight sensor on the roof. Mm -hmm. And if I did this right, these lamps should turn on once it gets dark. Mm -hmm. I didn't want to just leave Ruben here with nothing while we're at the building competition. He's coming with us. Really? <laughs> what kind of question is that? Of course he is. Okay, I'm not saying he shouldn't come. I'm not. But don't you think it's a little weird that you take him with you everywhere you go? He kind of makes us look like, I don't know, amateurs. He's my wingman. People always want to talk to the guy with the pig. You mean talk about the guy with the pig. Like, look at the weird guy with the weird pig. How weird. I didn't mean anything by it. I'm glad he's coming. I just don't want to give people one more reason to call us losers. I'm getting tired of it. Who cares what other people think? I know. I'm just... It wears you down. You say you're not a loser, Olivia. So win. Okay. Fine. Did you hear that? Oh, no. Boom! <laughs> oh, man. You guys totally freaked out. That was wrong. Axel! What's the matter with you? Great. Now I'm gonna smell like a pig in Endercon. Cool mask. It is, isn't it? Yeah, very convincing. <laughs> the look on your faces. Did you bring the fireworks? Of course I did. I even brought something for the little guy. Nice. You brought Reuben a disguise? Um, we're going to a convention. Somebody's gotta wear a costume. <laughs> He looks awesome. It only took me like a million hours to build it. All right, all right. You definitely brought the fireworks, right? Yes, I'm ready. Waiting on you guys. See, now he's your wingman. Stop. Hurry up and grab your stuff. We'll meet you downstairs, okay? Okay. Shears definitely taking these. Never know when I might need to shear some sheep. Gabriel the Warrior. You think we'll ever get that famous? It's not impossible. Maybe I'll get famous for my sweet poster collection.
Give me a dragon roar, Reuben. That'll do, Reuben. That'll do. I got this stand as a gift, but don't have any armor to put on it. Maybe someday. One of these days, we're gonna win the Endercon building competition. And when we do, people will look at us and say, hey, there goes Jesse and Ruben, winners of the Endercon building competition. You really should change the name. Hmm, flint and steel, not too shabby. That's everything. Let's roll. Yeah, dude. Roll. Let's go. I heard a pretty juicy rumor about the building competition, but you guys have to promise not to say anything. Okay. Also, it's in two parts. Each part more exciting than the last. Spit it out, Axel. Part one. The special guest at this year's Entercon is none other than Gabriel the Warrior him freaking self. Whoa, what's part two? Part two, according to my sources, the winner of the building competition is going to get to meet him. It doesn't mean anything if we lose. But if we win, oh man, this would make up for all the losing. Meeting Gabriel would be a dream and an honor. Totally, he's awesome. It'd be amazing to meet him. Reuben better be careful in that costume. The last time Gabriel saw a dragon, it didn't end well. So, does this source of yours make posters for a living? Huh? Yeah, my, uh, source, uh, doesn't exist. You guys are my only friends. Guys, let's stay focused. We have a competition to win. We never win. And this year, we've got Reuben with us. We basically have no chance. We're going to win because... What are you talking about? Because up to now, we've hated losing. But today, today, my friends, we're going to start learning how to love winning. That didn't sound as good as it did in my head. No, no, I'm with that. All right. Wait a minute, wait a minute. We're thinking about this all wrong. The point of the building competition isn't just to build something. We have to do something to get noticed by the judges. Okay then, so how do we do this? We don't just build something functional, we build something fun. After we finish the fireworks machine like we planned, then we build something cool on top of it. You might be onto something. If we want to get a reaction out of the judges, you build something scary. So I say we build a creeper. Wouldn't an Enderman be better? I'm more scared of Endermen than Creepers. They both have their moments. They're both pretty scary. All right, let's build the Creeper. You're going with Axel's idea? What's wrong with my idea? Nothing. It could be totally cool. It is cool. Yeah. I think this is the first time we've decided on something before getting to the competition. Think we've got everything we need? It wouldn't hurt to grab a little more. Let's get to grabbing then. We're so prepared. We can't lose. Cannot. Bring it in. Dare to prepare on three. No, 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 no. Preparing is daring. No, that's, that's the same thing. Forget it. Uh, team on three. One, two, three. Team! team. Prepare. Oh.
October building. We've got all the stuff for it. We are so ready. This year, it's going to be different. I'm not just ready to build. I'm ready to win. Nice pig, losers. Mm. Oh, great. There's Lucas and the Ocelots. The rivalry can continues. Man, they've got matching leather jackets and everything. So cool. Well, well, well. If it isn't the order of the losers. <laughs> Great. <laughs> the fail squad's here. Lucas, get a load of these losers. Let's go, guys. <laughs> name, please? Axel. And uh, how do you do? No, your team name. Team name? We are not ready for this. So much for losing anonymously. We're the order of the pig. <laughs> really? Is it meant to tie us to Reuben, or are you making fun of me? Okay, order of the pig. You guys are in booth five. Ah! Ah! Everyone in town is here. I don't like the look of this. Is that a freaking beacon? They have a freaking beacon? Freaking beacon? That's stained glass. They aren't just building a beacon. They're building a rainbow beacon. We're gonna lose. Our design is better. A creeper that shoots fireworks is cooler than a fancy light. Their difficulty score is going to be higher than our total score. We've got something they don't. Fireworks. We should probably stop staring at them. Ha ha ha. Look, it's the order of the losers again. <laughs> Good one, Gil. We're just looking. There'll be plenty of time for you all to out. I dunno. Maybe. Stop wasting your time, Aiden. We've got with Petra. You're cool with us. Whoa. Handshake? We don't have a handshake. We'll just <clears throat> make one up. We'll call it the, uh, the Builder Bump. Hmm. And just like that, I'm nervous again. Don't talk like that. We can do this. Just stick to the plan and everything will be fine. This year, the Order of the Pig can't lose. Let's do it. Building starts now. Oh no, a fireworks dispenser. I'm so scared. You worry <laughs> about your build, and we'll worry about ours. Here goes nothing. Oh man, that looks so cool. We'll win this for sure. The creeper was definitely the right way to go. Guys, people are looking at us. Good build, man. What? No way. It's just a bunch of dyed wool. Whoops. Oh no, Ruben's on fire! Ruben, no, come back! It was Aiden, that 
The lava's getting closer. You're gonna ruin the bill. Ruben's going to get lost. We've got to do something. But our build is about to go up in flames. You guys stay and save the build. On it. We've got to cover, Jesse. Be careful. We'll meet up with you at Endercon. Ruben? Where are you? Just give me an oink if you can hear me. Just oink if you can hear me. Could that be Reuben? Hmm, pig tracks. Ruben, I don't want to be out here in the dark. These definitely belong to a pig. Hmm, there's no way Ruben made these on his own. Carrot for you. Where are you, buddy? Reuben, where are you, buddy? I hear some pigs. Reuben, are you in there? Reuben! No, not you guys. Pigs! Hey, all pigs but Reuben, shut up! It's getting scary out here. Reuben? Reuben? Oh no, you in there, buddy? Oh jeez, please don't be toasted, Reuben. Ruben, 
There you are. Hey, buddy, you want a carrot? Oh, I'm so happy to see you. Ruben, run! I think... I think we're good. I think we made it! Out of the open. I want to show you something. Not that this isn't a really cool, dimly lit tunnel, but how far away is this thing you want to show me? Careful, Jesse. You don't want to get a reputation as a wimp. This isn't my first time in a cave, Petra. Yeah, but have you ever seen a wither skull? Whoa! Fresh from the nether. You're the first person I've showed it to. You risk your life for that dusty old skull? No, oh, I risk my life for the thing I'm gonna exchange for that dusty old skull. There's this guy I'm meeting up with at Endercon. He's gonna trade me a diamond for it. Being the resident go-getter pays off every once in a while. The guy you got the skull for, what's his deal? He's kind of strange, I guess. But hey, everybody's got their thing. And you never thought to ask him, hey, what's with your whole totally normal, not at all weird skull thing? As long as this guy is willing to pay, I earned that diamond. Wow. Wow what? In a single day, you went to the nether, you killed a wither skeleton, I mean, I did build a super cool statue, but still, it's pretty sweet being you, huh? You know, you could come with me. I mean, if you're too nervous, I totally get it. But I wouldn't mind a little backup. You want me to come with you? Consider it my charitable act for the day. I'll consider it whatever you want me to consider it, as long as I get to come. You just keep a crafting table down here? Comes in handy. Since that wooden sword of yours got busted... You're giving me a new one? Even better, you can make your own. One stick plus two stones equals one sword. Just grab what you need. Oh, okay, thanks. Hey, is all this stuff yours? No, we're just stealing from whoever was dumb enough to leave this here. Of course it's mine. Just making sure. Oh, here we go. 
Jack. Just place the pieces on the table. See? Isn't it better when you make it yourself?